and since the stadium's 100 years old, it's a perfect time. You said you once you made the decision, it wasn't going back. When was that decision made that this is happening? You wanted to entertain this? I don't know like what the exact date was, um, but um, once uh, you know, once I said I, I presented to John, and I said, John, I'd really, I'd like to do this. I think this is the right thing. But you know, you don't want to force your coaches to do things. And so John reached out to a couple of these coaches, and I said, you know, I think it would make sense if we're going to have the expense of putting this together. And so he he responded back, hey, they're interested. I think this would be a good idea. And then uh, then there was a little period where everybody was getting cold feet, and um, um, I said, John. And so I challenged John a little bit. Uh, you know, John likes to challenge administration on Dreaming Big. And I said, wait a minute, Dream Big guys worried about playing outside? So we had a little fun with it. And, um, and so, I don't know, it's, it hasn't been that long. It's probably been a couple months. And then it was working with the schools. We had a couple Zoom calls working with our team. Obviously, there's a lot to this. We've got a little bit of a crown on the field. We're going to have to build up. You know, there's safety concerns. I mean, so we're going to, and there will be more details that will have to come out. We'll, we'll, but we felt like we wanted to get it out as soon as we could because these programs have to release their schedules and people are going to be confused. What, what is going on here? So, and then we also had to get a concert lined up and, and an act. So. Any idea when that concert uh, and people will be named? Um, I don't know the exact timeline, but it'll be relatively soon. And uh, it'll be a recognizable name. I think people will be excited. Um, in that, um, will alcohol be served at the concert and or the matches? Yeah, so we, we, we do intend to uh, uh, go to the Board of Regents and ask for uh, an exemption again, and, and likely we'll do what we did at the Garth Brooks concert. I'm not sure exactly what the mechanics of it will be or um, well, who will hold the liquor license, those things, but we do intend to, uh, to do a similar thing like we did with Garth. Yeah. Trev, you mentioned the Board of Regents. I know that a lot of talk about stadium renovations is still under wraps 